is that? <laughs> the real great adventures of me, Tom Terrific. With mighty man Fred, the Wonder Dog. I'm Tom Terrific, great adventure lover. With mighty man Fred at my side, fill and run for cover. I can be anything you see, change my shape most readily. How I do it puzzles me. If you see a rocket blast, a sailing ship from sailing past, a little flea, a golden key, it's me. All kinds of fun things, I'm never just one thing, T-E-R-R-I-F-I-C, my name's Tom Terrific. Uh, 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 I'm Mighty Man Fred, the Wonder Dog, uh, and Tom's ever faithful companion. Chapter One of Robin's Nest Crusoe. It's morning and time for another great, exciting adventure, Mighty Man Fred. But where can we go this time? Let's go where the nights are six months long and I can get some sleep. But Man Fred, you just woke up. Well, let me see. A, we could stay here. B, we could stay here and sleep. C. <laughs> That's the answer, brainy thinking dog. I'll become a flying fish, and we'll fly out to sea. All I said was... Hold on to my tail, old fighter. We're off to the briny deep. All I said was... Keep a weather eye on the lookout for pirates, old mate, or maybe a ship in distress. No, please, Tom. All I said was... Hey! <laughs> We must be on a desert island. Desert island? <laughs> Good. I'll have an apple pie and a strawberry soda. Worry, worry, worry. He rash, Manfred. We've come upon a lonely old shipwrecked man. Hooray, Mr. Lonely Old Man. Tom Terrific and his mighty Manfred have come to your rescue. What's to rescue? I'm Robin's Nest Crusoe, and you're standing on my island. That's 25 cents admission, please. <laughs> Admission? To Robin's Nest Rest, a happy haven for tired travelers. 50 cents admission during the season. Do dogs get in for free? What kind are you? I'm a wonder dog. 25 cents, please. <coughs> worry, worry, worry. But if you're not shipwrecked, why are you worrying? Because the big Robin's Nest Rest annual underwater ball game is coming up, and now we'll have to cancel it. How come, sir? Because we can't get our uniforms. They're all locked in Davy Jones' locker, and someone has stolen the key. So who's the spoiled sport? Oh, don't be frightened. That's only Anchovy Dick, the neighborhood whale. He comes around every day to water my lawn. Have you seen any stolen keys floating around, Anchovy Dick? Why don't you ask Davy Jones? He has lots of keys. That's it. Maybe Davy Jones has an extra key to the locker. But where is Davy Jones' locker? Uh, straight down. Here's a map to help you. Thank you. That's 25 cents. <coughs> want a nose plug? Only a nickel. No, thank you. If you want a lift, Tom, I'm going that way. Terrific. Hop aboard, noble Manfred. We're off to the ocean bottom. Now, how low can you get? Manfred, what are you doing? In case it's a long trip, I thought I'd bring lunch. Davy Jones's locker. Wet your feet before entering. Hello. No, ma'am. This is not the Suez Canal. I lose more phones that way. Hello, Davy Jones. We're here to open Robin's Nest Crusoe's locker, but the key was stolen and... Sorry, no key, no locker. Those are the rules. If I made an exception for you, I'd have to make an exception for everybody. Hello? No, ma'am, we do not deliver fish. But where can we find a key to open the locker? Try Locksmith the Key Keeper. He's keen on keys. Thank you, Davy Jones. Well, let's go, Manfred. Yep. Tom, 
What do we do? Somebody thinks we're a fish. That's simple, Manfred. We'll just explain to the fishermen that I'm a boy and you're a dog and they'll let us go. Sixteen men on a red man's vest. Yo ho ho and a bottle of pop. <laughs> Manfred, we're captured by pirates. <laughs> And now, as our stellar attraction, introducing the piratest pirate on the seven seas, Pittsburgh the Pirate. Yeah, da 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 da! Keep your kitties away from me. I'm a very, very bad influence. Influence? Hide your tots by the lots, tuck them safely in their cots. I'm an awfully bad influence. Influence? He's so cruel and deceitful when he strolls down the street. Full of children, this influential cat turns his smiles all to scowls, their laughter all to howls, and their manners from good to bad. Because I'm bad. A special mean old cad. I steal lollipops from babies with no ifs and buts or maybes. I'm just bad. He's bad. I'm bad, 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 bad. bad, bad, bad. bad. Uh, he's just bad. <laughs> Thank you. Pittsburgh the pirate. You must be the one who took Robin's Nest Crusoe's missing key. And why not? He won't let me play on his team. If I can't play, nobody can play. Stand us for you. <laughs> me bucko, I'll have ye walk the plank. We don't have a plank. Build a plank. Zook, Manfred. As long as we're prisoners, we can never get the extra key to Davy Jones's locker. Hey, I'm hungry. Can't we postpone the rest of this adventure till after lunch? Tuner inners, how are Manfred and I ever going to get to Locksmith the Key Keeper now? Robin's Nest Crusoe is waiting to get his teen uniforms out of Davy Jones' locker. Oh, I hope we don't let him down. We'll meet Locksmith at last in the next part of Robin's Nest Crusoe. <laughs> part of Robin's Nest Crusoe. We've been captured by Pittsburgh the pirate who stole Robin's Nest Crusoe's key to Davy Jones's locker, which contains uniforms for the annual underwater baseball game. But there's an extra key owned by Locksmith the key keeper. Zook, Manfred. As long as we're prisoners, we can never get the extra key to Davy Jones's locker. <laughs> Well, well, this must be the dinner bell. Abandon ship! ship. Abandon ship! Parrots and children first! Uh, what's going on? You saved us, brainy thinking dog. You sounded the abandon ship signal bell. Uh, it wasn't the dinner bell? And now the ship is ours! <laughs> We'll sail to Locksmith the Key Keeper and get the spare key to Davy Jones's locker. Ready on the right, ready on the left. Batten on the front porch. Who's that? That's Tom Terrific. Keel hole the crabgrass. Want to sell him for a pet? He's my pet. Saf Manfred, we're not moving. Why don't we just go home, Tom? What do you say, old pal? Sail. Sail. That's the answer, Manfred. I'll turn into a giant sail, and the wind will carry us to Locksmith the Key Keeper. Are you sure you won't sell him? I always wanted a talking boy. <laughs> Land ho! Mighty Wonder Dog. To help. Stop him. He stole my keys. So, you must be Locksmith the Key Keeper. Excuse me. I'm Tom Terrific. Out of my way. And this is my noble... Help! Pittsburgh the Pirate has stolen all my keys. There he is. 
is. Oh, what a mean villain. He's throwing all the keys into the ocean. What'll we do now, Manfred? <laughs> well, I would suggest... <gasps> Yikes! Manfred has dived in to get the keys. Wait for me! Faff, Manfred, I don't see a single key, do you? Hi there, Tom. Hello, Anchovy Dick. That's the sound of keys. Anchovy Dick, come back. Did you just swallow a bunch of keys? 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 I just can't keep track of what I swallow. Why don't you walk in and look around the lost and found department? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go home, Tom. Golly, there's so much in here. How will we ever find Locksmith's lost keys? Keep talking loud, Tom, so I remember not to swallow. Uh, swallow? Manfred, you found the keys. Oh, eagle-eyed dog. Now, on to Davy Jones' locker. Here, Mr. Robin's Nest Crusoe, the first key I tried opened Davy Jones' locker. Oh, you brought back my uniforms. Now we can play our ball game. <laughs> Could I play too? It's Pittsburgh the Pirate. He's bad. There's no such thing as a really bad pirate. <laughs> I'm just playful. Please let him play, Robin's Nest Crusoe. Well, he can be umpire. That's 50 cents, please. Athletic fee. Manfred, now that our big adventure is over, we can go home. Thank goodness, Tom. I will not pay a fee for sleeping. Mighty Manfred, your blood will tingle when you hear what our next real great adventure will be. Oh, no! I think I'll stay home and watch you on the TV. Don't miss it, friends!